The power of touch in communication. Hello, English learners. Today we're delving into a crucial aspect of nonverbal communication, something that can profoundly influence the messages we transmit without even uttering a word. That's right, we're exploring the role of touch in communication. Before we get into the specifics of touch, let's briefly go over the basics of nonverbal communication. Nonverbal communication involves all those ways we communicate without words. This can include body language, facial expressions, and of course, touch. Understanding the nuances of nonverbal communication can significantly enhance your interpersonal skills and help you navigate various social situations. Touch is a powerful tool in our communication toolbox. It can express a range of emotions, from sympathy and love to dominance and aggression. Even simple actions, like a pat on the back, a handshake, or a hug, can convey powerful messages. Remember, the cultural context greatly influences the role of touch in communication. In some cultures, touch is frequently used to express feelings and to establish relationships, while in others, it's used sparingly and mainly within close relationships. It's essential to respect and understand these cultural differences when communicating. In a professional context, touch generally involves handshakes, high fives, or pats on the back. These actions can help establish trust, celebrate victories, and show support. However, it's important to remember that any use of touch in a professional setting should always be appropriate and respectful. Understanding the difference between appropriate and inappropriate touch is crucial. Consent is key in all physical interactions. Unwanted touch can feel intrusive and disrespectful. Always pay attention to the other person's comfort levels and respect personal boundaries. That wraps up our exploration of the role of touch in communication. Remember, whether it's a reassuring hand on the shoulder or a firm handshake, touch can significantly impact our interactions. Learning to use it effectively and appropriately can enhance your overall communication skills. As always, we hope you found this lesson valuable. Until next time, keep practicing and happy learning.